Okay everyone, now I'm heading to the hard off here in Nitsu. It's the Nitsu store in Niigata Prefecture. As you can see, we are in the middle of nowhere. But, we still got some cool recycle shops out here. Which are all the rice patties. Alright, so... Well, it should be up here, let me see. Oh, there it is. See that white building there? Is this Eco Town or Echo Town? Okay, so I'll see you guys inside. All right, let's start with the glass case. You got some core graphics consoles down there. Several Game Boys. Oh, there's a Hori Mini <coughs> for the 64. Let's see what we got over here. That's cool. It's a mini blaster for the Mega Drive. A little small. What is this? This is a Hori. Oh, this is for the Master System. Hori pad for the Master System. That's cool. And PC Engine. There you go. Dreamcast, Mega CD, Neo Geo CD, um, PC Engine down here. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it's Bomberman 93. Here's Persona 2 Deluxe Pack. Yeah, this is pretty cool. It comes with like a little stopwatch and I mean pocket watch and art book and things. Let's see what we got over here. Nothing much. Oh look at all the toys. Some Tomiko playsets in here. Anyway, uh, let's get back to the games here. That's cool. It's a green Dreamcast controller. There's a bunch of N64. Boxed games, Dream, uh, sorry, GameCube. N64 loose cards. Here's a. Uh, oh, they got a lot of boxed Super Famicom games and Game Boy games. Let's see, nothing really catching my eye here. It's usually about the same selection in these places. Anything good will be in the glass case. And here's the plexiglass case. There's R Type 3 down there. Love that game. Oh, Golden Axe for the Wonder Swan. I didn't even know that existed. It's Golden Eye. Let's see what we got. Zelda Rockman. Anything up here? It's Rockman X2, Mario Kart, Go Go Ackman, Sailor Moon, Super Genji. What's up here? Okay, anyway, um. Let's go check out the junk section, I guess. Wait, okay, let's see what's in here. Nothing much. Okay, anyway. Let's head back to the junk section there. You see in the distance. Got all the toys here. Mm -hmm. 
as you can see, they sell a lot of um, computer components and printers and musical instruments. But uh, anyway, here's some more consoles here. That is the FC Portable Super. That's weird. I've never seen that before. Anyway, sorry. Um, there's a PC Engine here. Whoa, that's really expensive for a Famicom. I wonder why. Well, but anyway, here's a disk system. This one, the belt was replaced. Everything's been cleaned out. It has a warranty for three months, so that's cool. Comes with everything you need. It's still a little pricey, but that's cool that they replaced the belt. Here's the Mark of the Wolves PS2 joystick. Okay, a bunch of 360s. Um, anyway, I'm um, sorry, I got sidetracked. So let's head back to the uh, junk section. What they got. Junk Corner. Okay. Where are the games? Look at all those PS1s. Man, they got a lot of stuff here. Okay, got a bunch of loose PSP games, uh, run-of-the-mill stuff here. Oh, Game Boy, <clears throat> excuse me. Bunch of Saturns and PS1s down there, Famicoms. Um, more Super Famicoms and Famicoms. Anyway, sorry, I had <laughs> had to take a call, but uh, here we go. It's all pretty yellowed. Uh, three bucks for a Famicom. Usually they do work. It's very rare I come across Famicoms that don't work. So, cosmetically, they're not in good shape, but as long as they work, this is some PS1s. See? Three dollars for a PS1. Pretty sure it works. Bomberman multi-tap for the Super Famicom. Here, okay, here's a Game Boy player for the orange GameCube. Okay, it's only one dollar, can you believe that? But of course you still need the boot disc. Uh, doo -doo. What is that thing? What's up here? What's some Famicom? A Famicom, sorry. Some Mega Drive. Okay. okay, that guy's checking out the games. Look at all the game cubes. Xbox. What's up here? A couple of PS3s, a bunch of PS2s. And a stack of games here. Oh, there's a PC Engine just sitting up here, chilling. 20 bucks for a PC Engine. Okay, well, that's it. That's the Nitsu store. So I'm going to go take a look around. So thanks again, guys, for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.